Today I'm going to be unboxing and installing brand new AI Neuro 3. I already have one Neuro 3 that's on my fish tank. It's the right here by where the return flow is coming. I've been having some issues with flow lately and it's mainly because I like to keep the power heads on the back wall and normally I keep the Ghanis here but the power head blows directly over them and they don't get any flow. So I'll be putting a power head on this side and hopefully two power heads going will cause more collisions, different wave patterns and forms and be in the flow now. So here's the brand new Neuro 3 power head. I just picked it up today from my local fish store. Just got paid. It was $180 and after tax it ended up being $190. I already have one of these pumps installed right here in the back corner and it's a great pump i love it and it's going to be replacing this pump over here which only does around 300 gallons per hour where the neuro threes can get up to 2000. all right let's get to unboxing this thing i love the videos where they just satisfyingly open up the box all right not too much packing here but i mean don't really know that much here it is, the power head. This is what goes on the inside of the tank that you attach to the back of it. Here's the magnet that goes on the outside of the tank, but for me, I'll put that on a different side. You can also control the power head with this right here. You can change between the modes or some mounting options. Let's open up this box right here. Box has some tiny different adapters, so if you're not aware of them, what else is in the box? The power brick. And that's all except for the guard instructions, which I will be putting on, and the quick start guide. We are going to put this on the very back of it. There you go, your adapter's installed. Now I will be installing the mem guard for my tank mainly just because I keep a smaller fish in my 40 gallon and I've had way too many instances of seeing small fish in the power heads whether they were sick or due to whatever reason I just want it on okay so you put the guard on match the little slit that they made with the wire you put this just directly in the middle of it it's not gonna go anywhere now let's go ahead and turn off my little power hand on my Apex. And I'm gonna get straight into the install. All right, and here is the AI Neuro 3 fully installed. I have them both set on random flow methods to go from zero, or I'm sorry, 75% to 100% with high variance. I know it's not an SPS tank, but um, it just seems that since I'm treating this tank like a peninsula, it the water just shoots out, hits the glass, and then doesn't really cause too much ruckus. Now update on the corals. This trachea has gotten actually humongous. Look at those colors, look at that, that pink. So it's extended on this side. Um, it hasn't really got too much color right there, which the Zoas are doing okay. This one's been like that for a while. Um, these are finally starting to come up, but I'm having this weird algae issue. I don't know what type of algae it is, but it keeps on coming back and I just keep on blowing it with a turkey baster because I cannot figure out for the life of me what it is. Finally having a ton of coralline algae growth. I'm very happy about that. I've been testing once or twice a week, every week to see how well my levels are doing. I also picked up this fungia. This orange fungia has blue tips. Good shot of it. Anyways, it has blue tips on it. They look really good in person, but it's hard to see. Also, I picked up this starry blenny. In my illegal fish hatchery that I have going on over here. Let's see if he is out still. There's a Melanaris wrasse in here. And I've been adding floss from my main display and I put it in here because it's seeded with bacteria. 
let's see. Okay, he's it's coming around the back over there, and I know it's super cloudy. I just poured some water in here, so that's why, but he is tucked around, hiding behind this pipe. There he is. Super scared. Um, I'm hoping he'll come out of the shell here pretty soon.